Welcome back to Raw Sports Talk. I'm Chris, your favorite stat reader, and we have the Canadians hosting the Flames. And the Flames are minus 120 on the money line. The Canadians are plus 120. The over-under is six and a half goals. The Flames, laying a goal and a half on the puck line, are plus 198, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two goals or more. And the Canadians, getting a goal and a half on the puck line, are minus 250, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you'd win. They lose by one goal, you win. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to puck drop tomorrow. There's no NBA because of election day. And for those who are not in the United States, they're going to elect the president. So uh, NBA took the day off. Uh, It's supposed to be Wolf in net for the Flames and Montembeau in net for the Canadians. Head to head, the Flames are on a two-game winning streak. The Canadians are 6-4. and The home team 6-4. and the favorites won the last two games they've played against each other. The favorite is 5-5 five and five on the money line, while the underdog getting a goal and a half on the puck line is 7-3. and three. There have been six one-goal games in their last 10 meetings. The over-under is 5-5, five and five, and the under at 6.5 goals is 7-3 and three in their last 10 against each other. They played each other twice last year. Flames won both games, 2-1 to one in Montreal, 5-2 to two in Calgary. The Flames are not playing very well right now. Two, four, one, and five in their last six. Five goals, six goals, three goals, six goals. Shutout and a loss, one goal and a loss, three goals and a win, two goals in a loss. When we flip it over to the Canadians, they are one and three in their last four. Seven goals, ten goals, nine goals, four goals, four goals and a win, two goals and a loss, three goals and a loss, and then one goal and a loss. So as of right now, how both of these teams are playing, it's like bad versus worse, but the Canadians are actually stringing together a few more wins than the Flames are. I'm going to take the home underdog. I'll take the Canadians with the money line. I will take the Canadians getting the goals. I think this is an under game. We'll see if either of these teams' offenses come to life. These are just my pick. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.